uh, we had 17 young mathematicians and applied mathematicians from around the country, all of them either doing undergraduate, senior undergraduate or master's degrees, thinking about what they're going to do next. Are they going to be the academics of the future? Are they going to be the Dan Spielmans of the future? It was a great opportunity to get to talk to a professor from Yale. He had so much knowledge and so much advice, um, not just about maths, but just life in general. And he was so enthusiastic about everything. It was great to get the chance to be so close and ask him questions and just chat normally. It was so very interesting to hear how he got into his field, because it is quite an unusual field and I loved that it was just that he was indecisive and couldn't pick what he wanted to do and has gone on to effectively revolutionize the field of maths. Arab have been re ver really very good in terms of uh, sponsoring this event and look keen to do that type of thing well into the future. I don't know when in my life I'd ever get the chance to pose questions to people of like the whole panel's caliber like other than something like this, which is just brilliant, you know. Very inspiring for the rest of my career. I really wanna go on and do a PhD now. It, it's encouragement, it's, inspir it's inspiration. It gives you a bit of a drive to work forward and what you know can you achieve because when you're studying, let's say, if you don't know what you can achieve with it, you kind of, you lose reason why am I doing this and you lose that, that drive. Your hard work has been worthwhile and you know, even if it feels like you're not understanding things at the time, you are and that's kind of moving towards something, especially like when you see the panellists that we had earlier today. Well, I, I study physics and I thought that that was a really interesting way to look at stuff that we're used to seeing all the time. He managed to do something uh, that's rather difficult. He explained some non-trivial mathematics in a way that I think ma non-mathematicians could feel they'd get something out of it.